What's going on guys, Firefrost Tech here, showing you guys the Autobox Defender Series case for the iPhone 6 and the iPhone 6S. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and put it on for you guys. So if you have a 6S, uh, as you know, it is a little bit thicker than the original 6. So for the Autobox, you do definitely have to have the one that is made for the 6S as well. So let's go ahead and open this up. Okay, so here we have the Autobox case. It comes with a belt holster, which is pretty nice. You can remove it by pushing up this tab here. Okay. Here I have the Glacier Color. It's essentially a gray rubber outer and a white hard shell. So to open this case up, essentially you're gonna to have to first push up the tabs from the bottom of the phone. So we have two here. And then we have one more on the side where the volume marker sits. So we push that up. And what we want to do is we want to take out the rubber very slowly. You want to lift it up very slow and then you're going to run your fingers all around the case. And you want to be very careful because if you pull it too hard then the rubber starts to stretch and it wears out the case a lot faster. So with this tab, you want to just push it up again and run your whole fingers. Okay. All right, so once you have all the rubber out, you can start pushing it out carefully. It should come out very easily. Let's put that on the side. So here we have the final stage here. So we have arrows indicating where all the tabs are. And all you have to do is push it down one tab at a time. I'm going to do it all around. Okay. Okay. There you go. So now we have the two piece open. So to put it on, before we do that, we want to make sure that we first clean off the screen of the phone and you can use a microfiber towel for this. I want to make sure there's no lint or any dust that sucks under the screen since the Autobox has the screen protector integrated. Okay. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to lay the phone on here, just like that. Then we place the top piece on top. And then all we have to do is just snap it in place. Snap it all the way down. And here it clicks. Once it's all down, we can now put on the rubber piece. Let's go ahead and put it all around. And again, you don't want to stretch this. You want to go ahead and lightly lift up and put it all around the case. So once we have that around, then we can start pushing the rubber inside the case. Just like that. Okay. Once we have it all around, then we can start making sure that all the tabs are pulled down. Okay, and I can immediately feel, it feels very, very nice in the hands. Love the grip. The buttons feel really nice. Okay, so we can see here the screen protector that's integrated on the Autobox. It's very nicely with the phone. It's very, very responsive. Okay, let's take a look around the case. So as you can see here on the bottom, we have all the ports covered. And essentially to access them, you essentially lift this port up to charge your phone. You can put that back down. And this here is a cover for the headphone jack. We have a little opening for the speaker. Here we have the power button. Here we have the volume rocker and the toggle switch is covered so you can lift this up here to access that. Let's place it back down. And on the back here we have a nice opening here that shows off the Apple logo which is really nice 
and we have an opening here for a camera flash and we have auto box listed down here I'm liking this color a lot so with this screen protector um, we have the screen covering the touch ID and actually now that I take a look at this it looks like it's actually been pulled out um, I normally pick up my I don't normally get my cases through Amazon and uh, today I picked this up at Best Buy and uh, looks like somebody has uh, used this case already which it's not that good um, I mean if, if, if I were you guys um, I would first if you're gonna pick it up at a store inspect the case first making sure that um, all the pieces are intact because they sometimes might return these um, but either way when you do have the uh, auto box and if it's not been tampered with this essentially be covered by a little membrane that works with the touch ID now some people like to remove these which you can just like this person did um, but uh, overall the case feels really nice in the hands definitely feel the nice ruggedness that the case offers the Fender series is perfect for rugged conditions and here we have the belt holster here so pretty much you essentially just lay the phone in and then you just push it in and you want to place it like this so that way the screen is not facing outside so that way when you have it on your belt you have all that protection here and the belt clip essentially lifts up over here and swivels 360 degrees okay overall highly recommend it and again guys if you're gonna buy it in the store I would highly recommend checking it out first uh, just to make sure that all the pieces are intact I uh, will have the link in the description for this case and guys, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks so much for watching, guys.